G'day and welcome to Investigating Quilts number 7. Today's quilt is by Janet Goyne and it's called Remembering Tucson. It was featured in the 2023 Mid-Atlantic Quilt Festival and I believe the finish size is somewhere around 38 by 38. It doesn't list it here but it is not a huge quilt. It was part of the Remembering Native People of North America and it was a challenge that one of the quilt guilds did and I love this quilt. It's so beautiful, so pretty. But the story goes that her and her husband Bob went to a small farm just outside of Tucson about once a year and they just really enjoyed the lifestyle and just enjoying the time out there, the colours, riding the horses, enjoying the southwest and especially the sunsets. And she went to one of the quilt shops nearby called Quilters Market, I'll get that right in a minute, and she found this kit for this quilt and it looked stunning so she picked it up, brought it home and put it in a cupboard for four or five years because she did this in 2015 then pulled it out in 2021 to make this for this challenge which was great and she said it was really nice that she was able to do that um it gave her a chance to actually go ahead and get this quilt done has that ever happened to you have you bought a kit put it aside and then had a good reason to pull it out and enjoy it the things i love about this quilt well i love the colors i think they're absolutely stunning and i love the different vibrant colors from the southwest and that they're all different textures if you look at it closely you'll see that they have um, some blenders some prints and also the background. At first I thought it was just one solid colour, but no, it's all different colours as well. I just think this is a really, really fun quilt. I'm not usually one that buys a lot of kits, but if I saw this kit, I think it would be very hard for me to leave it behind as well. So I hope you enjoyed today's um, quilt story. If you did, definitely hit the like button. Tell a friend, and I always love hearing comments from my viewers. So I hope you all have a great day. Happy 2024, and we'll see you next time. Happy sewing. Bye.